Hello everyone, welcome to RPA Learners and in this video we are going to see how to use copy table and clear table keywords in Robocorp and firstly the copy table and the clear table has only one argument which is table and we need to specify which table to copy and which table to clear so let's go ahead and see how these two keywords work in Robocorp let's jump into Visual Studio now this is our data table right firstly we will see how we can copy this table to another data table or a table object let's create another table object let's call it as dt1 and let's use copy table keyword and mention dt let's save this and uh, we are logging the dt1 the newly copied data table so let's go ahead and see what are the differences between these two keywords or from copy keyword how it is uh, displaying as the new data table right the execution is started and let's see after it ends it need to give the same data table that it has in the dt requires a table object right we need to provide it as a variable we are mentioning it as dt so uh, let's execute this again and this time we should get the output so it is successfully executed now let's go to the log file let's refresh this log you see here um, we have dt which has two columns and a zero rows and the copied data table or a table which has same name of the columns two columns and zero rows so it is definitely copying the data table from one data table or from ta one table to another table so let's see how we can clear that and let's use clear table keyword and we need to provide dt1 let's provide dt1 so that we will check that at the end let's save this and the clear table uh, clears all the rows but it will it will keep the columns so uh, as of now our data table doesn't contain any rows so let's go ahead and use some rows let's provide at the data let's provide column names so it will add two columns two rows to the data table right we have data a list of data and then a column names let's try and execute this uh, it has two rows now and two columns it will copy that the same data same table to dt1 and then it will clear the dt the table dt1 so it is successfully executed let's go to the log file let me refresh this you see here and our first data table dt contains two columns and two rows and the copy data table also has two columns and two rows the clear data table which will clear everything you see here it is still have two columns but zero rows and this is how you use clear table in the clear copy table uh, keywords in robocop and that's it for this video if you like this video please give it a like if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet please consider subscribing for more videos thanks for watching